Jeff Heineke's has it good feeling, ahead of the tie two footballing giants collide on Wednesday night as Bayern Munich take on Real Madrid in the first leg of their Champions League semi-final. Bayern are chasing their sixth European Cup, hoping to repeat their 2013 treble winning season, but they will need their strongest team against the holders and 12-time European Cup winners. Their veteran coach, Jupp Heineke's, who came out of retirement in September to take over Bayern again, said despite Real's strength and its two consecutive Champions League titles, there were no favorites. This match will be a delight for the football consumer because you have top players on both sides and teams play attractive, cultivated football, Heineke said, there is no favorite. Although I do have a good feeling for us, Donny Carvajal is confident Real Madrid can make history and become the first team to win the Champions League three years in succession. The Spanish giants became the first side to retain the European title in the Champions League era last season and are now aiming to go one better. Carvajal told the club's website, Nothing is impossible, we're going to fight for it, we're working hard and, if we've done it twice, why wouldn't we go for that third consecutive Champions League, since I've been here, I've been lucky that I've been able to reach the semi-final every year. Every year has something special and this season more so, do the teams we've come up against. We're happy and looking forward to playing the game, Graham Hunter discusses whether Gareth Bale has a future at Real Madrid after the Welsh star was left out of their squad against Malaga Graham Hunter discusses whether Gareth Bale has a future at Real Madrid after the Welsh star was left out of their squad against Malaga Manuel Neuer, Arturo Vidal and Kingsley Coman were the only Bayern Munich players to miss training on Monday ahead of their Champions League showdown with Real Madrid. Heineke's appears to have no fresh selection problems for the clash as the three absentees all have long-term injuries. Goalkeeper Neuer last played in September because of a foot problem, Chile midfielder Vidal is set to miss the rest of the season following knee surgery, and France winger Coman has been sidelined since February with an ankle issue. Zinedine Zidane's men have no fresh injury concerns after a weekend off from La Liga duty. Sergio Ramos is back from suspension while Nacho has returned to training. Zinedine Zidane's Real Madrid have no injury concerns This will be the third time since 2011-12 that Bayern Munich and Real Madrid have faced each other in the Champions League semi-finals, with the Germans progressing in 2011-12 and the Spaniards in 2013-14. Bayern Munich have lost each of their last five games against Real Madrid in the Champions League, with all five of those coming in the knockout rounds, three in the semi-finals and two in the quarter-finals, of managers to have taken charge of at least 20 games in the Champions League. This match features two of the top three managers managers in terms of win percentage, Jupp Heineke's, 71%, and Zinedine Zidane, 67%. Only Luis Enrique, 73%, has a higher win ratio in the competition. Zidane has lost just one of his six combined Champions League games against Bayern as a player, P4W2D1L1, and a manager, P2W2, with that only defeat coming back in April 2002 at the Olympia Stadion, 1-2. Cristiano Ronaldo has netted at least one goal in each of his last 11 games in the Champions League, 17 in total, the longest scoring streak in competition history. How can you really go against Real Madrid? They're the first team to win back-to-back -back titles and always have a chance with Cristiano Ronaldo's goals. However, I just feel Bayern have started to click. I've just got a fancy for them to go on and win this tournament, with Jupp Hankis repeating his feat of completing the treble before walking away. Charlie fancies Robert Lewandowski to score first The players are just so comfortable in their skins under this man and for some of them, it will be a fond farewell. I see Robert Lewandowski leaving in the summer and time is perhaps up on Arjen Robin and Frank Ribery, who will all be eager to go out on a high. Charlie predicts 3-1 in Lewandowski to score first 28 over 1 with Skybet.